Welcome to Find Me in the H.com. I am Moody, and it is my pleasure to be sitting here with a very funny and talented Mr. Tony Rock. What's up, man? Thank you very much. <laughs> it's my pleasure to be sitting here with Moody. All right, so you've been doing your thing for quite some time. What do you enjoy most about um, your career, the acting or like stand up comedy? Oh, not even close. Stand up comes first. <laughs> The act is not even a close second. Stand up is like stand up makes everything else possible. So, you know, I got the role on, on all of us because the casting director saw me doing stand up in, in LA. I got the role and we can play that game because the casting director saw me do stand up. So, stand up makes everything possible. I'm on tour because the owner of this club saw a tape of me doing stand up and said, let's bring him to our town. So, stand up makes everything possible. Yeah. Okay. Now, of course, we know that you are the younger brother of Chris Rock and you come from a very big family. Now, Wait, hold on a second. Now, see, this is, this is real. This is live right here watch this hey yo my man you can bring that in <laughs> see see how to see that see how it happens it's like the green room there's a lot of stuff going on <laughs> You gotta eat before the show. You gotta came eat. In and like, went back out. No, I'm good. I'm good. Thank you, bro. We're talking about your brother and yeah. and uh, your family. Now, what was it like growing up? I'm sure everybody in your family is funny. Is that? Yeah, I have seven brothers and one sister. Ooh. Everybody's hilarious. Chris and I are not the funniest two. Are not. Really? He will tell you that himself. Is we, it your we sister? Not, my sister's actually the funniest. My I knew sister, it. Yeah, she's the funniest. Girl. My sister's yeah. the funniest. <laughs> You two are not the funniest. Well, what's so uh, funny about the other others in the family? The the, the younger siblings kind of have a little bit of everybody else's style in them, so it's more of a, a, a across the board style of comedy. You know what I mean? So that I think that's what gives them the edge. Okay. All right. Now you have done all of us, and um, you have the Tony Rock project. Uh, project. Now tell us about that show. Tony Rock Project was my attempt to do. To pick up where Dave Chappelle left off. I wanted to do the Chappelle show, but Tony Rock's version. The only thing was, the Chappelle show was on cable TV. Mine was on my TV. It was on basic, you know, regular TV. So I couldn't get away with as much as Chappelle could being on cable. I tried to be so edgy with it, and every day I was just shot down. So the finished product is not exactly what I wanted it to be, but I was happy with it. Okay, no doubt. Well, now you're here in Houston getting ready to do your show. Now, what can we expect from the show? Uh, vulgarity. Racism, uh, alcohol, and then a lot of women in here after the show. All right, so now you're getting ready to go to LA for the BET Awards. Now tell us about that and like who you're getting ready to go out and check out. Uh, the BET Awards is my favorite weekend of the year in Los Angeles because my birthday is two days after. So my birthday party will be the Friday before the BET Awards. So I have that to look forward to. You know, see Beyonce and uh, hopefully Jay stops by and Wayne performs. I mean, I'm a fan of the music, so I'm, fan, I'm a fan of the culture. So I'm, I'm, happy, I'm looking forward to going to see everybody there. All right, no doubt. Well, you are tuned in to find me in the H.com. I'm here with Tony Rock. I'm going to get some laughs and, you know, go. <laughs> that's an H, you know. <laughs> that's the Tony Rock H town. Find me in the H. That's how we do it right here. Keep it locked.